Well, a new trend in lawn care is being tested and it doesn't involve any heavy machinery. Instead, the city of Stillwater is making use of some good old farm ingenuity. Here's our Keela Kellum. Well, Rob, while the drainage ditch behind me looks well kept, it hasn't always been this way. That's why the city of Stillwater enlisted in some four-legged help. Livestock trailers are a common sight in Oklahoma, but not along most neighborhood streets. Until the city of Stillwater, looking for new means of brush control, found a curious solution. Goats. Jim Scott is with the city of Stillwater. We've got some information from other communities around the nation that have done this and figured, you know, if it works there, let's try it here and see what happens. Using 12 goats from Langston University in an experiment, the city is trying to control some of the unwanted vegetation in a hard to manage drainage ditch. I've got in contact with Langston who uh, has a great program down there with goat research uh, and they were very, very happy to come up and, and work with us on this. So great, great marriage, great partnership. Terry Gibson with Langston University conducts extensive research on goats. Um, I've been at Langston a little over 12 years now. Uh, we've been working with goats as a means for controlling unwanted vegetation for about eight years now with several different projects. Projects include using GPS collars to track the goats in larger areas and see what they are doing when no one is looking. You can actually see what vegetation that they prefer, where they're going, where they like to spend the night. That kind of thing. So, yeah, they're going to, within an hour or two, they will have probably explored all of this. Now, goats are naturally curious and like to explore, but they also have a reputation of eating just about everything, which makes them very good at this particular job. So they'll consume plants that, that cattle and sheep will not, uh, but most of the plants that we look at into here were going to be consumed by goats. This right here, for the time being, Goats are fairly low maintenance. However, one issue that comes up is keeping them in place. The only downside, as you can see, would be the fencing, is that you do have to contain them. So containment would be the big issue. Uh, the upside is that they're a biological means of controlling unwanted vegetation. You don't have to come in and use chemicals. You don't have to come in and use mechanical means, such as chainsaws or other type of, of labor-intensive activities. So it's a, it's a nice way of taking undesirable brush and converting it into a, a very usable product. After one week, the handy goat mowers are down to just the nub, cleaning an area that only a goat can reach. And Rob, this project has proven so successful that the city of Stillwater plans to implement other goat mowing herds throughout the city. All right, thank you so much, Keela. You're welcome, Rob.